Hello, hello, good evening. Welcome, guys. Thank you very much for being in class. I really appreciate the opportunity. Thank you very much, Franco, Jose, Elias, Nehemias, Mauricio, Sochil, Iris, Daniel, Guillermo, Karen, Jose, welcome, Guillermo, I'm so sorry, Odalis, Fidel, Adonis, Isaura, Juan, welcome. Remember, guys, to have the complete name written down over there, eh? Full name, full name. Yes, help me out with that, Isaura. Please help me out with that. Full name written over there. Thank you. How was your weekend? Was it good? Uh huh. Was it a Too good short. weekend? Too short. Yes, of course. Always, brother. We want more. We want other Saturday, other Sunday. Ah, time flies. Time flies. Anyways, okay, guys, thank you very much for being here. I really appreciate again your effort, your dedication. Every every class, it's really important. And remember, English is easy. 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 The secret too easy. The secret is. Practice, 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 practice. Very practice. good. Remember that's the secret. And believe it or not, believe it or not, you are doing a good job connecting to class. This is the practice number one. Okay, so continue in that way. Continue in that way. Okay, let's start with the practice of listening, listening practice. Have you have you ever practiced in this web page, guys? Before? No. No, never, never, um, never. No. never. Okay, okay. So we are going to practice in every class, or at least whenever we can. One listening, one listening, one listening in every class. Okay. Let's start with this one. Acting a school in movie stars. Okay. That's it. So first let's check quickly some idioms here. We got some idioms. A balancing act. What is this? A difficult situation where you try to do several different things at the same time. For example, working and studying at the same time is a real balancing act, okay? Balancing act, what you are doing, you are having a real, real balancing act. Yes, like balancing from one to the other, working and studying, working and studying. High and mighty, self-important and proud, Sarah always acts high and mighty. And she thinks she's better than everyone else because she's a well-known movie star. Okay. Good. What is the activity? The activity is listen to this audio and let's answer the questions. When you finish, take a photo and send it in the group. Okay. I copy the link. And I send the link in the chat of Zoom. And I'm sharing the link also in WhatsApp. Okay. Good job. Individually, please. Lights, camera, action. Individually, individually.
I finished, teacher. Excellent job. Don't forget to take the photo and send it in WhatsApp, okay? We will send you a photo, teacher. Please, my friend, please. In the group or your personal was? In the group is fine. Okay, thank you. Good. Hi. Hello, hello. Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello. Good evening, mister. Right now, we're practicing listening. I'm going to share this, the link with you. In WhatsApp, there is a link in the group. Uh, thank you. What? Teacher, uh, such a list waiting to enter to the class. Uh, oh, sorry. Your approval? Yeah, right now. Sorry, sorry. Thank you, teacher.
Hola, Donis. Hola, hola, eh, yo ya contesté el cuestionario, no sé si eh, hay que hacer otra actividad. No, no worries, right now I'm just waiting for some other people to finish, but we're going to continue, no problem. Ah, ok, thank you. Ok, the next activity is this one. We continue with this listening script over here. Look at this. This is the listening script right now. Pay attention. Hello, this is James Goodfellow from Channel 4 News. Today, we're interviewing Sarah Roberts, the star of the new movie, Zombies on Mars, Part 4. Sarah, uh, thanks for joining us. You're welcome, Jimmy. Uh, it's James. Whatever. James. Well, let's start off the interview with a few basic questions. First of all, where are you from? Well, I'm originally from Miami, but we moved to New York when I was three years old. Oh. I lived there until I was 17, and then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. Okay, and where did you go to college? I attended Fernando School of Acting, and all of my teachers loved my acting. <laughs> oh, and did you have a part-time job while you were in school? Yeah, I worked at a movie theater, and oh. everyone loved the way I made popcorn. Really? Okay. And how old are you now? Well, I'm only 20, but everyone I know says that I look at least 22. All right. Okay. And what are your hobbies outside of acting? Oh, I love shopping for clothes and makeup and... and... And did I say I love shopping for clothes? Uh, you did say clothes. Oh, yeah. Well, do you want to take some pictures of me, you know, for well, your homepage or your blog? And you can even use them on your Facebook fan page. Uh, I think we'll be okay. Okay, well, um, oh, oh, look, all What? of my fans. Hey, gotta go, honey. Hi, everyone. <laughs> okay, some words that we might be careful with. For example, where? Where inner? Where inner view when? Where inner view when? Hello, this is James, good fellow, Channel 4 News. Today, where? Where inner view when? Inner. Where inner view when? Sir Roberts. Story of the news movie. Zombies. On Mars, give me the S, Salpina, yeah, the end. S, the pronunciation. Is James, well, the setting, the new basic questions. First of fe, fe, first of all, first of all, first of, first of all. I'm originally from Miami, but we moved, look, the, moved. Lived, moved, as yes, moved to, moved, yes, I moved to Los Angeles. Then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. And where did you go to college? Where did you, did you, did you, loved? And my, all of my teachers loved my acting, loved, loved my acting. Yes, here again, loved. Her hobbies worked, worked. Yeah, I worked at a movie. I worked at a movie theater and everyone loved. The way I made the popcorn. Okay, well, how is outside acting? Shopping. I love shopping. Okay. 
shopping. Shopping center, for example. Remember to have the complete name, guys. For example, in the case in the case of Jen, okay, Jen, complete name. Otherwise, you're you are losing minutes. Some pictures for me, you know, homepage, your blog, things. Okay, very good. Gotta, hey, gotta go, gotta, gotta go. In groups, please. No, in groups. In pair, in groups of three. Let's practice this conversation, please. Lights, camera, action. I'm going to copy the link. I send the link in the chat of the class. And I also send the link in the chat in WhatsApp. Jimmy? Uh, it's James. Whatever. Well, let's start off the interview with a few basic questions. First of all, where are you from? Well, I am original from Miami, but we moved to New York when I was three years old or I leave it there until I was 17. And then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. Okay, and um, where did you go to college? I attended Fernando School of Acting and all of my teachers love my acting. Oh, and did you have a part-time job? A part-time job while you were in school? Yeah, I work a movie theater and everyone loved uh, the way I made the popcorn. Really? Okay. And how old are you now? Well, I'm only 20, but everyone I know, I know say that I look, I look at least 22. All right. Okay. And what are your hobbies outside of acting? Um, I love shopping for clothes and makeup. And, and, and did I say I love, I love shopping for clothes? Oh, you did say clothes. Oh, yeah. Well, do you want to take some pictures of me? 
to know for your homepage or your blog, and you can even use them or your Facebook fan page. Fan page. Oh, uh, I think well, I think will be okay. Okay. Well. Mm, oh, oh, look, all my fans. Hey, gotta go, honey. Hi, everyone. Okay. Hello, this is James Goodfellow from Channel from Channel Four News. Today We'll interview Sarah Roberts, the star of the of the new movie Zombies on Mars Part 4. Sarah, uh, thanks for joining us. You're welcome, Jimmy. Uh, it's James. Uh, whatever. Well, let's start off the interview with a few basic questions. First of all, where are you from? Well, I'm originally from Miami, but we moved to New York when I was three years old. Oh, I lived there until I was uh, 17, and then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. Okay, and where did you go to college? I attended Fernando's School of Acting and all of my teachers loved my acting. Oh, and did you have a part-time job while you were in school? Yeah, I worked at a movie theater and everyone loved the way I made the popcorn. The way really? I made the popcorn. Really? Okay. And how old are you now? Well, I'm only 20, but everyone I know says that I look at least 22. All right. Okay. And what are your hobbies outside of acting? Oh, I love shopping for clothes and makeup. And, and did I say I love shopping for clothes? Oh, you did say clothes. Oh, yeah, well, do you want to make some picture of me, you know, for your home page or your blog, and you can even use them on your face Facebook fan page? Uh, I think we'll be okay. Okay, well, um, oh, oh, look, all of my fans. Hey, you gotta go, have a knee. Hi, everyone. Okay. Adiós. Qué rápido. <laughs> sí. Okay, okay, great job. Let's see. Next activity. The next activity is to practice reading. So open your beautiful book, please, of Elephant Man. The last class, which chapter did we read? Chapter one, chapter one, right? Hmm? What was yes. the chapter that we, yes. uh -huh. In chapter number one. Chapter number one. Or you don't remember. And a meeting in this moment is praying, is praying.
Are you tired, Ana Miriam? Tired? No? Okay. Some of you, I see that some of you are, are preoccupied, worried today. I don't know. You are like, what's going on? Ah, okay, okay, okay. No problem. It's okay. Let me see. Even Ada is like distracted today. Distracted like. Ah, uh, you're working, working and in the class. Huh? No? Okay. Chapter number two, please. Chapter one is here. Let's continue with chapter number two. Okay, chapter number two. The card. The card. Listen to the audio of chapter number two. And then reading groups, chapter two, please. Good pronunciation, good fluency, and emotion, okay, emotion. So next day at seven o'clock, I came to the shop in a cab. There were not very many people in the road because it was early in the morning. In November, it is dark at seven o'clock in the morning, and I could not see the shop very well. I waited, blah, 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 blah. Okay? Lights, camera, different groups, different people. Remember, you share all the screen, okay? All the screen. Para que se escuche el audio. One, two, three, go. Hello, hello. Welcome. Are you ready? Sea, Miss Sea. Ivan Sea says over there. No. No. Tengo que cambiar el nombre que me acabo de desconectar del teléfono y a la PC. Entonces aquí tengo que cambiar el nombre, teacher. Okay, I, I can help you. you. Know your full name? Eh, Isaura Yamilet Ayala Medrano. Okay. Is that okay, Isaura? Sí, sí. Thank you, teacher. Okay, very good. I'm going to send you to one group to read the book. Ah, okay. People in the road. It was early in the morning. 
in November. It is dark. Remember, guys. Excellent, Emilia. Sorry to interrupt. Remember, yes. guys, that the first activity is to listen with the audio. Oh, okay. do, you, do you have the audio? No. Guys, no? Okay. No, teacher. Okay, let, okay. Me, let me look for the audio. Let me see. I'm okay. going to share it. I guess I sent it in the group. Yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna send it again. Check the group, please. In no, I'm going to eliminate it right now. I'm gonna give you an answer here. Audio. Okay, look. Tika, 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 help me. We're playing with that. Can you play the audio, Juan Carlos? Okay. okay. Thank you. He walked very slowly. Remember, open... guys, sorry, sorry to interrupt. Oh, okay, remember the first activity is to read it with the audio. So I'm going to resend the audio in the group. Y para que se escuche, o sea, para proyectarlo y que se escuche la misma vez, seleccionen. Compartir audio también, creo que. Oh, ajá, compartir audio, pero pantalla completa. O sea, no solo la, la pestaña, sino que la pantalla. Para que a pesar que esté usted mostrando el PDF, también se tome en cuenta el audio de otra pestaña que está activa. Okay. Uh -huh. I sent the I sent the audio in the group. I did not see America. I have audio. Uh -huh. Very good, very okay. good. Pero tiene que adelantarlo porque solo es uno. No se busque la hasta donde chapter two. Live here now. You aren't going to leave the hospital. Not today, perhaps. He's at his back. Under the coat. Remember, What's guys. Horrible? Sorry to interrupt. Remember, guys, that the first, the first activity is to listen the book with the audio. I sent the audio in the group. Please try to share the audio over there, and then you practice reading. Okay. Podemos hacerlo otra vez. Sí, hemos empezado a hablar. No Okay, no problem. You can continue, and when you finish, you listen to the audio. It's okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Very good. Okay. Very good. Thanks. Saw his body. He had an enormous black hat on his head, like a big box. A gray cloth came down from the hat in front of his face. There was a hole in the cloth in front of his eyes. He could see out of the hole, but I could not see in. He wore a long black coat, too. The coat began at his neck and ended at his feet, so I could not see his arms, his body, or his legs. On his feet, he wore big shoes like old bags. He had a stick in his left hand, and he walked very slowly. I opened the door of the cab, got out. Good morning, Mr. Merrick, I said. Can you get in? Help my upper steps, he said. I I'm sorry, I said. I don't understand. For a minute, he stood by the door of the cab and said nothing. Then he hit the cab with his stick. 
steps, he said loudly. Help me up the steps. Then I understood. There were three steps up into the cab, and he could not get up them. Yes, I see. I'm sorry, I said. Let me help you. I took his left hand and began to help him. My right hand was behind his back. I felt very strange. His left hand was like a young woman's, but his back under the coat was horrible. I could feel the bags of old skin on his back under the coat. He put one enormous foot on the first step, and then he stopped. After a minute, he moved his second foot slowly. Then he stopped and waited again. Hello, sir. Can I help you? I looked behind me. It was the postman. And behind him, I could see three young boys. One of the boys laughed. The postman smiled. Is the gentleman ill? He asked. I thought quickly. Yes, but this is a lady, not a gentleman. I'm a doctor, and she's ill. Take her hand so I can help her better. The postman took Merrick's left hand, and I helped him with two hands from behind. Slowly, very slowly, Merrick went up the steps and into the cab. One boy was very near the cab. He called to his friends. Come and see this, boys. A fat lady in a black coat. And look at that enormous hat. The boys laughed. They were very near the cab, too, now. I closed the door quickly. Thank you, I said to the postman. That's all right, sir, he said. She's a strange lady, sir, isn't she? She's ill, that's all, I said quickly. We're going to the hospital. Goodbye, and thank you. The cab drove down the road to the hospital. I looked at Mary. That was difficult, wasn't it? I said. At first he said nothing, but then he spoke. His voice was very strange, but I listened to him carefully, and I could understand him. The steps were very difficult, he said, but most things are difficult for me. Yes, I said. Nothing is easy for you, is it? No, he said. He was very quiet for a minute. Then he said, Who are you, sir? Who am I? Oh, I'm sorry. My name is Dr. Treves. Here, this is my card. I gave him a card with my name on. Then I thought, That was no good. This man can't read. But Merrick took the card and looked at it very carefully. Then he put it in his trousers pocket. I did not talk to him very much at the hospital. I looked at his head and arms and legs and body very carefully. Then I wrote the important things about him in a little book. A nurse helped me. Merrick looked at her sometimes, but she did not smile at him or talk to him. I think she was afraid of him. I think Merrick was afraid, too, because he was very quiet. At four o'clock, I took him back to the shop in a cab. The next day, I looked in the shop window again, but the picture was not there.
Chapter 3. That's it. Now try to read it, right? Each of you is going to read a paragraph. <clears throat> okay. Good. I go. Trump, chapter two. So next day at seven o'clock, I came to the shop in a cab. There was not very many people <clears throat> in the road because it was early in the morning. In November, it was dark at seven o'clock in the morning. And I could not see the shot very well. I waited five minutes. A postman walked past. Then the door of the shop opened and the creature, Mary came up. I could not see his face or his body. He had a, a enormous black hand on his head like a big box and gray coat cut down from the hat in front of his face there was a hole in the clothes in front of his ear, his eyes. He could see up of the hole, but I could not see him. He wore a long black coat too. The coat began at his neck and and at his feet so I could not see his arms. Okay. Next his body or his legs on his feet, he wore big shoes like old bags. He had a stick in his left hand and he walked very slowly. I opened the door of the cab and go out or Good morning, Mr. Merrick, I said. Can you get in? Um, I... And you pay steps, he said. I'm sorry, I said. I said, I don't understand. For a minute, he stood by the door of the cab and said nothing. Then he hit the cab with his six steps. He said slowly, Help me up the steps. Okay, Anna, it's your turn. Okay. Then I, I understood there were three streets into the cab and he could not get out get them. Yes, I see. I'm sorry, I said, let my help you. I told him his left hand and began to help him. My right, uh, 
at was paying his bag, I felt very strange. His left hat was like a your woman's, but his bag, you under the pot, it was. Oh, how do you Horrible. 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 I could feel the bad of all skin on him, but under the coat. He put one enormous, enormous foot on the first step. And then he stopped it. After a mi minute, he moved his second foot slowly. Then he stopped it. And wait again. Hello, sir. Can I help you? I look and be busy. Picking me, it's what the postman and begging him. I call the three young boys, or uh, one and the boys target. The postman smiled. Is the little man in? And three months, it no se puede close. He has kept his toe with glee. Yes, but, but this is a very no, I can't three months at a doctor, and she still take her. Ah, so I can help help her better. Okay, so it's a Oh, see you. Next. Eh, solo si puedo bajar un poquito la página, por favor. Ahí o más. No, para que se vea la primera lengua. Ah, uh, pero se quedó aquí. So I can help her better. Ok. The postman to Marix left him. And I help. And I help him. Without hand for behind. Slowly, very slowly. Marix went, went up. They step into the cup. One voice was very near the cup. He called to his friend. Couldn't see the voice. A fat lady in blackout. A new cat. The enormous hand. The boys louder. They were very near to the cup too. I closed the door quickly. Thank you, I say to the postman. That's really, that's all really, uh, that's all right, sir. He said, she's a third lady, sir, isn't she? She, she, Heal that's how side was to leave. Okay, quickly, do you remember that the last class 
we practice this, right? Size, weight, price, dimensions, battery life, storage, function, warranty. Now it's time to move on with this topic. It says, how much and how many? How much does the refrigerator weigh? How much does it cost? How much is the warranty? How much does it storage? How much? We use how much when we refer to things or to objects that we don't I don't. Count. Count. <laughs> count. Very good. Now we count. don't count. Count yes, is one, two, three, count. For example, water. Can you count the water? Yes or no? One no. water. Two no. water. No. All right. Can you count the sugar? Sugar. Yeah. No. No. Can you count the salt? Salt? No. Oil? No. no. Can you count alcohol? Yes, it's Daniel. No, no Daniel. <laughs> no. Only <All> drink. Right. <laughs> Only drink. <laughs> Very good. Can you count the hair? No. no. Very good. So how much? Much for things that you cannot count. In the opposite, how many? Many for the things that you can count. When we talk about money, 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 money. How much or how many? Mm -hmm. When we talk about money, how, how much, much or how many? How many? Much. How much? How much? For example, you go to the supermarket and then, hey, I want some bananas. Let's see. How much are the bananas or how much or how many are the bananas? Are how, much? How, how much? much? how many? How much? How much? How much? The question, the question is how much? But the answer, the answer is $20, $1, $2 the pound. But money in general, how much? Okay. For example, the question number two, how much does it cost? Cuanto cuesta? Look. How much, how much does it cost? How much, the, very common, how much does it how much does it cost? Oh, forty dollars, fifteen dollars, twenty dollars, uh, eleven dollars. Ten dollars. Now, how many, how many features? How many colors? How many functions? How many products? Where is the teacher? How many colors, plural? How many functions? How many products? 
Number one, how much or how many pieces do I need to assemble this? How many? How many? Very good. Mm -hmm. How many pieces? Plural. Number two, cost. Talking about money. Cost. How much or how many? How much? How much? How much? How much? How much? How much? How much do these books cost? Three. How much or how many? How is many? The, look, pay attention. Is the battery life? Life, how, how much? How many? How, how much? much? How much? How much? Yes, life. Hours. Hours. How, how much many? or how many? How, 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 many? Many? how many? How many? How many? How many? Ah, but if we refer about time. <laughs> Imagine here, imagine in this case, no hours. The work time. Do I need how much or how many? How much? How much? How much, how much time? Okay, it's similar to money. Number five, money. How much? How much, How much money do you have? How much? Six gallons of water. Ah, gallons. How, How many? many? How many? How many? Because gallons is plural. Water, no. But you say gallons of water, it's okay. How many? Yes. How many? Very good. Perfect. It's time to practice. Let me see. Exercise number one. Number two. And number three. Let me see. How much? How much, how many, how much, how many, look. How much, how many, now this, no, this is repeated. And how much, how many, now repeat it. Okay, what's the third link? My goodness, link number two. Repeat it. Okay, only two links then. Two links. Link number one, how much, how many, how much, how many. Link number two, how much, how many. Click countable and countable, countable and countable. And you click on finish. I'm going to give you seven, eight minutes to complete these activities, please. Let me see. In groups, only one photo per group. Only one photo. I send the link in WhatsApp, two links.
Entonces, los pájaros sí se pueden cortar. Hay aquí. Están aquí. Están aquí. Así. Oh, many. Oh, many. Oh, many. Bueno, por eso, no, entonces, no. por eso en la segunda sería how many? How much? No, um, ajá. Water is, is a sin. Esa, el agua no se puede contar. El agua, pero ¿y la gente? El, tampoco. Vive bueno, en... eso es lo que le decía. La segunda. Es lo que le decía, se me fue el nombre. Ajá. La ah, dos sería ajá. how many? Ajá, mm. la, la cinco, cinco, cinco. Bueno, déjame así, pues. La cinco, how much? El dinero en um, el banco se puede contar. Creo que es how many. How many. Okay. ¿Cuántas ciudades? Países hay en el mundo. Igual uh -huh. bueno, eso se puede contar. How much? How many? Uh -huh. How much? Ah, sí, perdón, perdón. How many? <laughs> Um, es que yo me estaba um, acordando de lo um, que nos había dicho el teacher anterior de por el, el dinero del banco. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Eso. ¿Cuántos sí. panes? Es. Te comes ah, por día o algo ese, así. Uh -huh. Sería how many. Eso sí lo puedes contar. Sí. ¿Cuántos huesos? Sí. En el cuerpo y humano. O menos también. Es... A la arena. La arena. Ah, ¿Cuánta sí, arena esos hay? son huesos, ¿verdad? No, no. Bones, sí. eh, huesos, sí. Entonces, esos sí son los. La información del internet. Igual, uh -uh. how much? Much. ¿Y qué tomamos una captura del grupo? ¿Qué? No. ¿Cómo la, uh, la dos. Creo no, que cuando se haga la encesta, ¿no? La dos. Esa no es la última. Creo que sí, que solo quiero una imagen. Pero la dos Pero... no me convence. ¿Ah? ¿La dos? Pero lo tenía en. Hello, hello. Teacher, we have a question. Yes, sir. <laughs> uh, here, here it is wrong, but we are sure that that it is correct, but we don't know why. Uh, maybe, porque está todo en mayúsculas. Maybe. Ah, oh, okay. Pero veamos. No, no lo borra. Vamos a ver. Veamos más un zoom. Dele más. Ahí está. Dele más, más, más. Ok, how much stars, esa es how many, porque se pueden contar las estrellas. O sea, no todas las que hay, pues, pero puedo decir, ahí está la, la, la no sé. Sí, sí se pueden contar las estrellas. Los tres, tres reyes magos. Ah, ahí está, no sé qué. O sea, sí se pueden contar, no todas las que hay, pero puedo decir dos, tres estrellas. Y no solo referirme a las estrellas del cielo, sino que movie stars, por ejemplo. Estrella de, 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 del cine. Lo que dice es pues, in the sky. Ah, in the sky, uh -huh. ajá. Pero en inglés las toman como, y como casi como en español, pues que, ah, ¿cuántas estrellas tiene la constelación? Que no sé qué. Hasta ya forma Capricornio, no sé qué. Ya, así las toman, cinco estrellas, cuatro estrellas, no contarlas todas. Luego, many people, está bien, many people. Many birds, it's okay. Much water, it's okay. Many money, no. Much money. Much money. Porque la palabra dinero en general, dinero, es incontable. No podemos decir tengo dos dineros, tres dineros, cuatro dineros. 
La palabra que es contable es dollars. Dollars. Eso sí. O, o centavos. Uh -huh. Centavos, 25 centavos, 30 centavos. Pero money, in general, no. Countries. Countries, many. Bread, it's okay. Bones, it's okay. How many bones? Much sun, it's okay. Much information, it's okay. No problem. Continue with the next link. Y le mandamos este que está todo mal. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes, it's okay. It's okay, send it if you want, because para que vean que ya se terminaron algunos. Mm -hmm. Lo corregimos, teacher, entonces. No, 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 así mándenlo, porque ya lo, ya lo vimos nosotros aquí, no problem. Bueno, yo no sé que la gente se puede contar, entonces me falta. ¿Cómo se puede contar? 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 How many? Para How many apples? Stars are the sky. Bueno, ya dijo que tiene que ser how many porque si son contables. Ajá. Uh -huh. bueno. How do we need to how much? How no, much? How many? Bueno, tiempo, un tiempo, dos tiempos. Ajá. Basándonos en la lógica del, de lo del dinero. How much, how much time do we need? Where is in the class? How much? Is how much? Pero especifica en el vaso. Entonces. Pero no creo que no puede decir water, how many. Water. Pero creo que no me puede decir how many water. Ajá, o sea, si especificara como la categoría de mililitros o algo. Ajá. Uh -huh. eh, books, how you get. Eh, Ahí sí, how many. Money, how many books can money can we spend. Pero dice dinero. Dinero, ajá. Uh -huh. How much money, creo que. No es how, no how much. How much money. Mm -hmm. Ajá, uh -huh, ese es how much money. Can we spend people in Poland's kitchen? Aquí sería how much. How much people in Poland is speaking Chinese. Mm -hmm. No sería how many. How many people in Poland speak Chinese. Pero La crees persona. que te tengo ese dato. Cuando sí. personas ah. hablan en chino. Yo creo que sí, se podría contar. How many people? Cosas. Yo creo que sí. Ajá. Ajá, many. Él sería um, how much. Antonio how much. Antonio no. in are how many class. students? How many students are there how much in your class? Many, do you want? No. Hey, how much? Sí. How much meal do you want? How much? Uh -huh. uh, el dinero es uncountable o uncountable? Uncountable, uh, uncountable. Un, ahí es. Cool, countable. Escuela, es countable. Ah, sí. Countable. El red, countable. Un, uncountable. No. Red. Ah, yo creo que es uncountable. Ah, porque un pan, dos, vamos a decir un pan, dos panes. No sé. Sister is countable. How many sisters? Sister. The sugar is uncountable. Uncountable. Uh, word book. Countable. Count. How many word books? Uncountable. Uncountable. Email. Email. 
Entonces, ponte, porque Ponta, bueno, sí, tú porque encontras está la misma Concha, bueno. Uh -huh. Los libros son... No, ese es Concha, el libro. Bueno. Sí, los libros son Conta, bueno. Ok. ¿O no? Es que siento Sí, que Concha, es demasiado, bueno. Concha, bueno. demasiado amplio. El... Ajá, porque no, o sea, no dice... Para No, contar yo creo cuántos que el libro libros. sería un contable porque no puedes Uh contar todos los libros que... -huh. Sí, yo también creo que sería un conto. El de Ah, Burke. ese Rubish. El Rubish que es. Es el Contable, cubo de... que es Rubish. Creo que el libro sí sería contable. Es un cubo. Sí, es contable. Sí. Porque puede contar los libros. Yo El dudo yogur que es un creo contable. que no. Es... Ajá. El yogur es un contable. Sí, El un contable. carro es contable. Ese es contable. El rubish. Que es el ¿Qué es Rubich? Ese no sé qué es, no sé qué es. El café es contable. O es un contable o contable. El café no, no es contable. Es un contable. Un contable. Dice Rubich El contable de basura. Basura es Rubich. Rubich es basura. Ah, pues un Rubich contable. es basura. Porque no puede contar Sí. la basura. Como Un reactivo. contable. El coffee Coffee. es un contable, Un contable. las tías, este Conta sí es contable, contable. el tiempo El tiempo es un contable es contable también. No, el tiempo sí se puede contar. ¿Crees? ¿Por qué? Pero es que El, recordar el lo tiempo. que nos dijo, recordar lo que nos dijo en el anterior, Un contable. un tiempo, dos tiempos, tres tiempos. Ajá, Ah, pues sí, es un el contable. que fue el libro. Un contable. Es cierto. Es pues La contable. manzana es Concha, contable. Y el Y el metal metal es contable. un contable. Es un concha, bo. Uh -huh. Y me salen todas malas otra vez. Y otra vez todas malas. <ríe> Ay, no. Pero, Y la Jenny hasta se fue. Dale. se fue. Ah. Dale, dale, ni modo. Se fue a contar las pupusas. Yo Vamos no viendo sé de tema. pupusas. Vaya Ok. y tarde. ¿Cuántas buenas tenemos? ¿Dónde está? Arriba, arriba, bruto. Arriba, arriba. ¿Dónde está la nota? No sale. Y él lo mandaste ya. Le di check más Bueno, o menos. vos tomó la captura, chi. Va que no sale la nota. No hice fue el botón de. de... Bueno, Ah, aquí la está, de tu o cuadrícula sea, están está abajo. marcadas en verde, ¿ves? Ajá, eso sí, Ah. la de arriba. Está buena. Teacher. Are you here? Yes, No, sir. primero. We we go check on check my answer, but don't have a. Y esa ya estaba en la esquina, en la esquina. En la esquina superior izquierda. Que siempre nos dice how much. Ten, ten out of ten. Very good. Excellent. Oh, Ten out of ten. Thank Mm -hmm. Good job. Good job. you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Jonathan, Okay. hay que enviarle. Sí, ahorita no. ¿Y ahí vas a poner los nombres o cómo? Yo creo que no es necesario. Sí, yo creo que hay que poner los nombres. Okay. Y vamos a poner a la Jenny que no nos ayuda. Excellent job, guys. Next activity, pay attention. Work with a partner, read the conversation, then switch roles. It says, the new material just arrived in the morning. Tell Max that he has to store everything. Where does he have to store the boxes? He and Ivan have to store them in the warehouse. Okay, but there are many boxes. Can they use the lift? They have to use the lift. But ask and tell the secretary first. She is going to stay, I'm sorry. She's going to say they can use it. Then I'm going to tell Max and Ivan what they have to do. Has to, have to, have to. Warehouse. Lift. Lift, Carlos. Go. 
y quedamos con una duda en el grupo eh, con el tema anterior. Ah, ok, Eh, perfecto, brother. eh, si es eh, algo, o sea, contable como las estrellas, digamos, o los planetas en el, en el universo, es, si fuera planeta sería how many planets are in the universe, aunque Excelente. no se puedan contar. Cabal. Uh -huh. Very good. Very good. Excellent, brother. Thank you, Carlos. Other question? Remember, Lo mismo con las estrellas, perdón. Mhm. stars, yes. Uh -huh. Porque stars, la palabra stars, aunque ahí decía in the sky, se refiere más que todo a cuánto Por ejemplo, hay unas estrellas que están así en más línea que le llaman los tres reyes magos. Entonces, ¿cuántas? No sé qué, 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 qué es el nombre específico. Pero, ah, por ejemplo, le están enseñando a los niños, no sé, pues hay unos que forman la osa mayor, no sé qué. Entonces, pueden hablar, pues, how many stars form, for example, the... What the big bear or the old bear? También aplica para estrellas de cine, estrellas del teatro, no sé. He is a movie star. They are movie stars. Okay. Volunteers to read the conversation, please. Who said me, teacher? Me, me, teacher. Don't you? Very good. And me, me, who is me? Who is me? me, <laughs> Isa. Karen and Isa, okay. First round, Sochil and Karen. Second round, Isa and Jose Me, Elias. teacher. Okay, and Adonis, and Adonis, very good. Okay, one, two, three, action, go. The new material just arrived in the morning. Tell Max, he has to start everything. Everything. Sorry, everything. Very good. Where does he have to store the boxes? He and Ivan had to start the in the warehouse. Warehouse, very good. Next, okay. Okay, but there are many boxes. Can they use the lift? Uh -huh. They have to use the leaf, but ask and tell the secretary first. He is going to say they can use it. Then I'm going to tell Max and Aiden what they have to do. Good job. Second round, attack. The new material just arrived in the morning. Tell Max that he has to store everything. Where does he have to store the boxes? He and Ivan have to store them in the warehouse. Okay, but there are many there are many boxes. Can they use the lift? They have to use the lift, but ask and tell the secretary first. She's going to say they can use it. Then I am going to tell Max and Ivan what they have to do. Very good. Okay, in this moment, let's continue practicing, but in groups. I see some people, some other people that want to participate, but part do this activity in groups, okay? Three or four minutes, five minutes, no more, because we need to continue with another activity, okay? Only practice the conversation, practice in groups, different groups, different people. Let's see. Lights, camera, action.
हेलो 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 ओह ओके नो प्रॉब्लम आई अंडरस्टैंड आई अंडरस्टैंड Sandido, how are you, my friend?
Okay. Uh -huh. Look at this exercise here. Max and Ivan or Ivan have to or has to. What is the correct form? Have to. Has to. Has to. Have to. Have to. Have to. Have to. Have to. Okay. Have to. Why? Because it's plural. It's plural person. Max and Ivan, they. They. To Aaron doesn't or has to help the store the boxes. Has, has, to. has, has to. to. Has to help. Okay. Very good. Sam doesn't have to or doesn't has to. Why? Because when you use auxiliary, the verb is normal, not their person. Okay? When you use auxiliary, um... uh -huh, the verb is normal. For example, he doesn't go. She doesn't play. No plays. Because auxiliary does, has the S. The okay. secretary have to or has to? Has to. Has to. Teacher, what is this, teacher? Has to. Have to. What is this? We are talking about obligations. We are talking about obligations. And before checking the grammar, okay, before checking the grammar, let's have an exercise, a listening exercise right now. Pay attention, please. Give me one second, I'm gonna share it. This activity is individually. Look, what does Susan have to do on Saturday morning? Where does Susan have to go? What time is Susan meeting with Julie? What will Susan do after she cooks dinner? Why can they watch a video at Susan's house? Pay attention, I copy the link. And I will share it in WhatsApp and in Zoom. WhatsApp or Zoom. <laughs> Lights, camera, action. Attack, please. Individually. Individually. Go. Uh,
Okay, let's continue, please. Look at this, guys. Have to and don't have to. Affirmative. I have to. Have to is an obligation. I have to store these packages. Okay. They have to take everything to the warehouse. We have to ask for permission. The truck driver has to bring the material. Has to because he's driver, one person. He has to use the lift. Okay. Obligations. I have to work every day. I have to help other people. I have to travel. Obligations. What is the negative form? The negative, I don't have to store these packages. They don't have to take everything to the warehouse. We don't have to, don't, don't. And third person doesn't. The truck driver doesn't, has to. Oh, there is a problem here, there is a problem. That's an error, this is an error. Doesn't have to. Doesn't have to. Have. Doesn't have to use the lift. Have to. Okay. Complete these five sentences, please. Individually. Using. Using the correct form of have to. Have to. Has to. Don't have to, doesn't have to. Buy new material, buy lab containers, negative. Not sign, negative. Not sign the letter. Design new models, negative. Not work until late, okay? Lights, camera, action, individually. When you finish, one photo, one photo. Teacher, ¿en dónde lo vamos a hacer? Perdón. Ok, you can do it on, you can do it on your notebook. And, oh. uh -huh, and then you take a photo and send it in the group. Ok, gracias. Ok. Teacher, I have a question. Yes, bro. Uh, we need to add the had to, or we need to add more words. 
No, have to or has to. For example, number one, pay attention. The company have to or has to? Has. Has to. Has to. And what is the, the activity? Buy. Buy new, new material. material. Only that. The company has to buy new material because it's positive. Number two, positive. Number three, negative. Number three is negative. Number four, positive. Number five, negative. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you, teacher. Okay, we're good. Thank you, Alfonso. Thank you, Daniel. Very good. Thank you, Frank.
Excellent, Calderon. Calderon. JJ Lara. Okay, number two. Your partners uh -huh, have to, has to, have what to. is, have to, your partners have to pile up, okay. you can say the containers or only containers. Three, the agents, plural agents. Awesome. Uh, Mm. To. Negative. Don't have. Hey, don't, don't, have. don't have to sign the letter. Why don't teacher agents plural teachers mm -hmm. students? Mr. Bonilla. Ah, Mr. Bonilla is one. Mr. Bonilla has to. Has to. Has to design new models. models. The group. The group is only one group. One group. Negative. Doesn't, Doesn't. work. I'm sorry. Doesn't have to work mm -hmm. until eight. Very good. That's it. That's it. Okay. Um seven, eight, two, three. Let me check only one thing here. Right here. Okay, tomorrow we finish unit number two. Okay. Tomorrow we finish unit number two and we have an oral activity in groups. Okay. Yes, in groups. Please, homework for tomorrow, study the verbs, regulars, irregulars, read the book, Okay, léanme ese libro. Puede ser que aquí lo hayamos leído y lo vamos a leer con el audio. Ok, pero no les puedo... Pero siempre que lo mande leer, con el audio. Bueno, no, a veces le puedo decir que lo lean sin audio. Pero la idea es que usted lo lea con audio para por lo menos escuchar y ver cómo se van pronunciando las palabras. Porque si no, lo que pasa es que uno inventa. Ok, en el momento no a la ley como caiga y... Pero eso significa que en la casa, antes de acostarse o no sé, a la hora que usted más le guste, ponga el cronómetro, ponga un cronómetro. Esa es una técnica de estudio, poner un cronómetro. Y lea 15 minutos el libro, o 10. Tal vez no se va a leer el capítulo entero en esos 10 minutos. Pero aunque sea una página o dos bien leídas, suficiente. Este es nuestro momento para aprender la pronunciación de la ED. Esa pronunciación ED es la, la clave. ¿Ok? No solo eso, sino que tener una mayor comprensión. Bueno, pues repito, puede hacer que lo lea una vez y no lo entendió porque se estaba enfocando bastante en la pronunciación, fluidez. A la segunda vez le habré entendido un poco a poco. ¿Ok? Por ahí, a veces uno de estudiante se aflige y, se, y, y, y le agarra una gran desesperación. Que uno dice, ay, yo no hablo, que me cuesta, que no sé qué, que no sé cuánto. Ay. No, preocúpese por estar en cada clase todos los días, por hacer la tarea, lo que uno hace todos los días, pues, como dicen los japoneses, es más importante el proceso que el resultado. O sea, es más importante que en un carro se vaya poniendo pieza por pieza bien armado, porque al final va a quedar un carro de calidad. Es igual aquí. 
Es importante que cada clase usted asista, participe. No solo voy a estar ahí viendo, sino que participe. Pero aparte de eso, en su caso usted haga un horario. Le digo porque, pues sí, es práctica. práctica. Después de esta clase, usted, algunos están bien cansados ya. Otros necesitan un cafezazo. Otros están con trabajo ahí acumulado, pero, o sea, está haciendo un buen trabajo porque se conecta a clases. Pero para que usted vea un poquito más el, su aprendizaje, haga un horario y, quit, y quitémonos a veces las redes sociales, porque eso es un gran vicio. Entonces, en vez de hacer una hora de TikTok o una hora de Instagram o no sé, no sé qué otra red social, Entonces, 10 minutos leo el libro, 10 minutos repaso los verbos y 10 minutos veo, canto mi canción favorita. Ah, 30 minutos suficiente. De 10 y de 10 y media ya estuvo. Haga eso todos los días y me va a contar. No del 1 al 10 va, sino que me va a relatar qué que, que bien le va en el aprendizaje. Okay, bye bye. Take care. Have a wonderful, amazing night. Hope you rest and see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Take care. Bye, teacher. Bye. See you later. Bye.